Hey, what's up guys? My name is the number one Pred, and today what I'll be bringing you guys is a hit fire only chem strike with the ARX. And you guys may be thinking, the ARX, the worst assault rifle, aka the worst actual gun in Cog Ghost. Okay, guys, you guys, some of you guys may already know why I've chosen this gun for the hit fire, but for those who don't, this gun is a really, 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 really good choice to go over hit fire. As you can tell visually on the screen, there's a little uh, laser that's red protruding out of uh, the hindsight, or is it? No, foresight, sorry. And uh, it obviously increases the hit fire accuracy, just like uh, the guns with the laser attachment did in Black Ops 2. And this is the only gun that actually has it, so it's you know a little bit unique in that sense. But if you put this in combination with steady aim, it is an absolute brutal attack, uh, brutal loadout for you guys to choose. It's probably the second best actually out of any gun you could choose to hit fire with. Oh, let me get. Oh, I'm mistaken there. The chainsaw, but then again, that doesn't count. I'm not going to count that. I might go for a gameplay about both. Let me know what you guys think about that. But uh, yeah, this is definitely the second best uh, hit fire gun in the game. Just because of the laser, obviously the first one, the, the best one, sorry, would be the MTAR X. Obviously because it is a more mobile choice and you can put rapid fire and it still works amazingly. Hit firing only. So hopefully you guys enjoy the gameplay in the background. Please, please, please drop a like rating. Uh, if you did enjoy, that would be much, much appreciated. And comment down your thoughts about the gameplay if you want to as well. Completely up to you. But in today's commentary topic, I'm going to give a shout out to a good friend of mine, and then for the second part, I'm just going to ask a, a certain, you know, niche audience, should I say? That doesn't really make sense. That's a different term. But um, just a, a guys who are actually skilled in like a certain aspects, which I'll go into in a in a little bit. But first thing I'm going to give you guys uh, this guy a shout out who I know in real life and at school. His name is on YouTube is Joti Gaming or Joe in real life as you guys can probably gather from uh, his YouTube name and basically what he posts on his channel is FIFA 14 and other games that are actually really really cool and really like really up to date new games he does walkthroughs on games like Watch Dogs and you know the new releases on PlayStation 4 he plays PlayStation 4 so obviously the quality in that is absolutely immense on his channel um, but mainly he posts FIFA 14 and FIFA 14, and I, although I'm not a big you know, fan of it, I mean, I do love watching it on channels like KSI and Road to Shore, but um, FIFA 14 is actually a really, really, really fun game when you watch it on his channel. Basically what he does is, he does like, I can't remember what it's called, is it? It's something, to, it's something when you play against a computer, it's like, I think it's Seasons or something like that, I don't even know. Um, that's what that just shows I'm not really a big FIFA 14 fan, but um, what he does, he plays against a computer. And I'm just not going to be horrible or anything, but he's not amazing at FIFA, he's not great at all. I think I could probably beat him if I played him, so maybe I could play him one day, that'd be kind of funny. But um, once he lost to a computer, I think he lost to, uh, actually I don't know what team, but it was a really, really bad team in the Premier League. And he goes ballistic, and the raging he does is absolutely hilarious. You guys have to check it out. Um, it's a really, 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 really funny guy. You guys need to go check out his channel. I will drop a link in the description on the first row. So let's try and boost his sub count up by at least 10 to 20 subscribers. That definitely be much appreciated from him as well as me. So if you guys could do that for him and me, that would be super, super awesome. Don't let us down. But once again, you don't have to if you don't want to, but I am highly, highly recommend you should. And the last thing I want to talk to you guys about today is just, um, if any of you guys do thumbnails, please, please, please hit me up on YouTube, PM, or uh, in the comment section down below, and I will PM you my Skype. I really, really need thumbnails because I've had a recent error with my, um, with my uh, Photoshop, and that's what I normally use to create my thumbnails, but whenever I click on it, there's an error message that pops up. I'm going to click on it now and just see what the message is that comes up. It says, could not initialize Photoshop because the preferences file was invalid. In brackets, it has been deleted. I have absolutely no idea what that means because I haven't deleted anything off of Photoshop uh, related or anything off my computer other than, you know, gameplays that I don't want to use. 
so I don't know where the hell that's come from but if any of you guys have a solution to that at least please let me know or if you guys would be willing to create free thumbnails for me that'd be awesome so please please hit me up on Skype or YouTube PM and I will hopefully see you then but once again please go and subscribe to Joe T Gaming in the description down below and as well if you guys do uh, are good at thumbnails and can do it for free that would be much appreciated as well I'll give you all shout outs in the description that as well just to let you guys know but once again hope you guys enjoyed the video and check the links down below and I will see you very soon peace